Another day, another iPhone lookalike comes into the world. But why is this one more special than the others? One word, Google. After the launch of the iPhone, how could Google sit back and do nothing about it? So here comes the Google phone dubbed the Nexus One. Design-wise, the Nexus One looks pretty iPhone-ish and runs on Google's very own Android operating system, version 2.1. It comes packed with features like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, a whole host of apps and Google navigation. Sure, all smartphones these days come with that. But prepare to be amazed by Google goggles. Click a picture and Google will analyze and generate search results. Goggles recognizes landmarks, books, contact info, artwork, places and much, much more. Everyone wants to be associated with the Google phone. So who will be the carrier for the Nexus One? Well, it's going to be Google themselves. Google is planning to sell the phone without any carrier attached to it. Google is thumbing down telecom operators with a monster VOIP plan to back it up. With what? Google Voice and the purchase of Gizmo 5, a full-fledged VOIP telco. Get a Google Voice account and users can now make calls end-to-end -end using Gizmo 5's technology. And guess what? Google doesn't have to pay a penny other than that required to scale up Gizmo 5's technology to handle the massive amount of switching and the customers pay for the service themselves. But this phone is not going to be cheap. Rumours are that the device will be priced around $500. Although T-Mobile is supporting the device right now, why would you need a carrier? What does this mean for consumers? Throw out your SIM cards because all you need is the internet. What does this mean for telecom companies around the world? Google domination. Radhika Sharma, ET Now, Mumbai.